So hello guys, my name is Caleb. Sorry, I don't like this angle. That's a nice angle. So, spoilers. You know, I avoid spoilers like the plague. If I'm reading a book, I don't look at anything about the book. I just avoid all possible ways I could be spoiled. And most of the time, I don't get spoiled, and that's nice. I don't get spoiled very often. I took a break from the internet for about two weeks. Um, during that time, I was reading Clockwork Princess. Then I read them all unspoiled. Finally got to know all the stuff about the books. So, I've been gone for two weeks. I haven't checked YouTube. I haven't checked Twitter. I go onto my YouTube uh, see in my little bell thing. I have a few notifications. I just click through them, see your comments. Love your comments. You guys are 100%. A human decided to leave me a comment. I had finished Cocker Princess like two or three days before. So I knew all the stuff. This human commented on one of my more recent videos, but I had been gone for two weeks so it wasn't recent. I had finished all the books but in that video I said I was reading Clockwork Princess I think and this human leaves a comment saying not even like oh my gosh I love that book I just blah 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 spoilers inserted throughout no it was literally one sentence just says the ending of Clockwork Princess oh my gosh okay first I finished that book so what the heck two why are you leaving a spoiler in someone's comments do you want them to be spoiled and hate you because you're a troll and you're an idiot or do you want everybody else to go through and see the comments and see your dumb troll comment your spoilers didn't work it was the comment was up for two days and if any of you saw it I am so sorry and I blocked that human at least I think I blocked that human I'm not gonna lie I have no idea how to block people I don't know but their comments are gone I finished the book it doesn't matter I don't think a lot of people have seen that comment anyways so then <laughs> they then left another comment on one of my videos video from like a year ago the chances of people seeing that slim to none I was talking about crown of midnight in that video and they spoiled that. They just straight up spoiled Crown of Midnight. Why? I don't know why you would do that. I don't know why one human would think that's a good idea. It's sick. But the thing is, I've read Crown of Midnight too. Your trolling doesn't work. I've read the books that you try to spoil me on. I've talked in like a million videos about how I've read that book, so I don't know how you missed that unless you just watched like two of my videos and decided to leave spoilers on those two videos. I don't know. You're still a horrible human. I don't even know what to think. Why would somebody leave that comment? The thing is, you still didn't spoil me. I, I read the book. If you would have maybe watched one video where I said I read that book, you wouldn't feel the need to tell me what happens at the end of the book. I know what happens in the book. I read it. And then there's this rare class of people that I cannot stand. These are the people that spoil themselves. These are the people that get a new book and they immediately flip to the last page, read the last chapter of the book, spoiled. Why? That doesn't make sense to me. I've seen people in class in the middle of a book and then they'll just start flipping pages ahead and then they'll be reading the end. I don't get that at all. That's like watching a movie, just skip to the last 20 minutes, watch that, and then go back. What's the point? That's like going to Applebee's, buying chips and salsa, not eating it. That's a really bad analogy. Hold on. Okay, that's like buying chips and salsa. It doesn't have to be Applebee's. You buy chips and salsa, okay? This chips and salsa, they're made to be together. You gotta eat them. You gotta eat it like a normal human being. You don't go to the Applebee's and drink the salsa and then leave. Okay, Okay, that was a really bad analogy, but I hope that makes some sense. Why? Why? I still don't want to know why. I think we're gonna conclude. Spoilers suck, humans suck, and the world is dead. I don't get why people spoil other people, and I don't get why people spoil themselves. It's dumb. You gotta be cautious with spoilers, and cautious of people, apparently. So thank you guys for watching, I'll see you in my next video. Bye! I come out here every day and I expect to see some beautiful stuff. This kid is playing with a trash can. <laughs> like really reevaluate your life. Like I just want to make a video. <laughs> so the book smells really good. It smells like a like a clean textbook. Um, not like the nasty textbooks at school, but like what I picture like the U.S. Constitution smelling like. I don't. Trading sugar cane and rum and all the things he can't afford. Scamming for every book he can get his hands on. Near and less than that. Planning for his future same now as he stands on the bow of a ship. Heading for a new land. In New York you can be a new man. New York you can just do it. New York you can just do it. That's why I'm deleting my channel. Bye. Just kidding. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna be jewel books on you. <laughs>